The Calhoun County Sheriff's Office gets a boost for its school resource officer program. As LA Martin reports, a car dealer in a neighboring county has stepped up to help. Just last week, as a school resource officer was driving from Vardaman to Pittsburgh, his vehicle, a backup vehicle in the sheriff's fleet, broke down. Those are the vehicles that have 200 and plus thousand miles on them. Like I said, the second day on the job, one of them broke down and we had to have it towed in. The three newly hired school resource officers, or SROs for Calhoun County Schools, are using older vehicles in the fleet. But today, Steve Eaton of Eaton Chevrolet Buick GMC in Houston presented Calhoun County Sheriff Greg Pollan with this Dodge Charger Police Edition. Eaton saw a social media post by Sheriff Pollan talking about the need for vehicles for the SROs. We're the local dealer. We, what better way than support your local officers and your school system both? And we got together and decided we needed to furnish them with a vehicle, and so that's what we're doing. In local governments, whether it's county or city, there's never enough money to go around. That's why it's vital to have private businesses step in and help meet those needs. I immediately went to my board of supervisors who were super supportive of this. The school board has been phenomenal. Dr. Langford has been phenomenal. So it, this is a collaboration between, you know, four entities that all came together to get this done. And it, it, it shows what can be done when you work together. Calhoun County SROs say knowing they have the community support makes their jobs easier as they work to have a positive influence on young people. Especially in the elementary and middle school, because those kids are very impressionable at this age. We want to give our, the impressionable where you can come and speak with an officer, not be standoffish. Uh, and that's what we instill with all the all the SROs now. We we took we go in, we in, we sit down and eat with them at lunchtime, and we tell them not to, to come talk to us. That's what we're here for. Very grateful. Uh, they're stepping out and giving us this car. Uh, very supportive. Um, that's, you know, just being supportive of law enforcement in general. Sheriff Pollan is looking for two more vehicles for the district SROs. Telling your story in Houston, Allie Martin, WCBI News. Sheriff Pollan hopes to have the SRO, SRO car striped and painted within two weeks so it can be used by the Vardaman School Resource Officer.